good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and it is time to get ready for our flight risk lesson. So, my friends, let's get cracking. All right, friends, this involves a little bit of reading. Make sure you and a partner read about the weather event. You're going to be the dispatchers. This is the flight. It's going to be at 1230 on January 27th. You're working at Chicago O'Hare, and this is the weather map that's causing trouble. It shows that ice and rain are going to hit Chicago. Both of you need to immediately think about that flight that is scheduled and that you have to have a plan ready to deal with that weather. You need to work to come up with a plan for the 5 a.m. flight that is the best solution for passengers, crew, and the airline. You have three options to pick from. Option one, continue with the flight as scheduled. Option two, cancel the flight. Option three, delay the flight. If you look at the weather forecast, this shows you on January 27th, the storm will be a mix of rain and snow at 1.15 a.m. When you hit the tab, it shows you from 1.15 to 1.20, it's predicted to rise, and then the snow will turn into freezing rain. If we move to 4.30 a.m., the storm will decrease in size and turn more towards the northwest. Remember our compass, that northwest does matter. And then finally, by 5.30 a.m., the storm is predicted to pass through the area. So with that information, you need to carefully read these schedules and determine which one you think is the best choice and put that in your Project Lead the Way notebook. A, you need to select the one that keeps the passengers on schedule and provide evidence. B, select the option of the three that keeps the passengers safe. And then C, and C if you were the dispatcher, which of these would you choose? Once you have those written in your Project Lead the Way notebook, you need to use the Google Sheet Gantt chart for this flight, where we do file, make a copy, and put our initials in front of it as well. You can close the original and just keep the one with your initials. Notice this one's going from O'Hare to Boston at 5 a.m. And then return to the crew revest event and using our skills from earlier, fill out the Gantt chart for these people. Real quickly, if we look at Carver, available January 26th. Our flight was January 27th. They only have 30 hours. So we simply would go to Carver and they are available for the whole time. And once again, we click and we click, and that's how you show the captains, orange for the first officers, and purple for the flight attendants. And then friends, once you've completed that, return to your Project Lead the Way notebook, and in there write down who the captain, who the first officer, and who the flight attendants will be. Also, the ethical scenario, discuss with your partner what you think would be the best choice if you were responsible for the people flying in those airplanes. Of course, friends, if you found the video useful, please give it a like. If you got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button, and last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.